Good morning. It is Wednesday. We are almost halfway through our seventh week of online learning, our last kind of full regular week of school. So if you would look, I have uh, taken down another day. Today is Wednesday, May 6th. So I hope you are ready to get through this day and um, have another day taken care of. As far as pledges go today, today is Wednesday. So I just ask that you watch Miss Judy's chapel service and you can um, say pledges with her. You'll have to do them twice. So as we're moving on, let's look at the national day. Today is National Nurses Day. Oh, what a wonderful, wonderful job nurses are doing right now. They are taking care of sick uh, people all around this world, in this country. Um, just, you know, being there with them, not only physical comfort, but, you know, a lot of people, they can't be with their families right now as they're sick. So they're providing that emotional support as well. So, you know, we just thank you. Thank you to all of our nurses that are, you know, just working tirelessly to provide health care for people in the United States, again, and around the world right now. I'll just give you a little history of Nurses Day. In 1982, the United States Congress designated May 6th to be National Recognition Day for Nurses, and President Ronald Reagan signed the proposal. The American Nurses Association Board of Directors later expanded the celebration in 1990 to a week-long celebration. So not only is today National Nurses Day, but today begins a week of celebrating nurses. So if there's a nurse in your family, uh, one that's studying to be a nurse, tell them thank you. Tell them thank you for all their hard work that they're doing. So uh, again, as I said before, Miss Judy will have a uh, chapel service for you next. So when you're finished with your chapel service, we'll be ready for math. 